Junior libero Ali Yurkovich joining me of the Robert Morris volleyball team. And Robert Morris coming off two very impressive and necessary wins, for that matter, uh, at home against the Brooklyn area teams, LIU and St. Francis Brooklyn. Uh, what impressed you the most about the way the team played in uh, picking up those victories? Uh, I think the best thing that came out of this weekend was the way that we finally decided to finish matches. Um, in the past, we've gone through lulls at the end of sets at 20 or 21. We'd let them come back in, and that's been our uh, Achilles heel for sure this season. So we finally decided to finish a few matches and close out some wins. We've spoken with Taylor Lord, who just recently got a thousand career digs. You almost exactly a month ago prior got a thousand career digs uh, in that win at St. Francis University. Uh, what did that mean to you to get on that list and to be alongside some of the other players who are on that list for that matter? Uh, I'd say it's definitely one of those things, you know, I didn't even realize when, when coach told me the next day of practice, it was like, oh, that many already. <laughs> um, but I definitely say it's over the years, it's just one of those things that adds up. And before you know it, it's there. And I think a lot of it comes from playing behind our tall front row this year. That's definitely nice to play defense behind. <laughs> and um, being so comfortable with Taylor after so many years of playing defense together. And along with Allison and Erica, they're just great to play with. So that helps a lot. And on a personal level, what does it mean to be sort of a, a, a local, a Whippeal success story coming from the, all those great seasons at Thomas Jefferson and clearly making an impact on the Robert Morris team in the last couple of years? Definitely good to see some Pittsburgh pride on the team. Um, you know, you want to represent the local area and the Whippeal, so it's good to see names coming up in the NEC, especially so many on our team now. So. And uh, this weekend, you're going up against Sacred Heart, a team you have defeated already, a straight set victory in your very first match in this building, the North Athletic Complex, and a Fairleigh Dickinson team that might not be in the running but is looking to play party crash or they're going to be at home. Uh, what do you look for out of those teams this weekend? We're definitely going to see some competition out of both, really. We don't go into any matches not expecting competition. Um, really looking for the second win over Sacred Heart on the first night, so... We're going to have to go in and play hard like we usually do. We don't play any team different than another. So, Junior libero Ali Yurkovich, she's not done yet, and the Colonials not done yet as they try to extend their season by getting to the postseason. Thanks, Ali.